pressure gauge, water pressure gauge. These, on, these only last, this one was eight years old. The one I replaced prior to that was three years old. Water gets inside there. So I'm gonna see if I could take this apart and see what's inside. See all the crusty stuff inside there. This was, this dried out. I've had it off for a few weeks. So that's released. Maybe this part just pries off. I don't know if it's glued or what. Zero pressure. Cracked. Got it. No screw holes, it's just glue, I guess. It's still good, I could put it back on. The water infiltrated there. So this ring of copper, it's soldered here to the brass, soldered to the brass coupler that curves around. That's connected to this lever that has gears on the top. So when this, when this changes, It turns a, a smaller gear inside there. And that changes the pressure. There's also a spring, very delicate spring right there. I guess that's what turns it back to zero. How the heck would that work though? Water is flowing inside inside this orifice oh this thing this must be hollow so that's how it works this is hollow water goes in through the orifice goes into this tube this is a tube and then the more pressure the straighter it, it gets and as that straightens out from more water pressure pushing it to go straight, it moves the needle. Very clever. Water goes through here into the tube. The more pressure, the straighter that goes. And it moves the cam and uh, moves the needle. And inside it is a tube. See that? So that's exactly how it works. And that's it. Inside a um, pressure gauge.